closely. If we're lucky, one of them might even yawn. You'll see that they've got some nice aggressive teeth as well. Such cool little animals. Look at the details. Beautiful soft fur. Quite small ears. I mean, most of the sounds they make communicating a very high pitch, almost whistle like sounds. fantastic to get such a close and personal look at one of them. Like I said, beautiful coats with the fur on them. They're one of the prettiest, softest looking animals out here. You can almost imagine them like a little teddy bear. And the facial features are also quite petite. Little, quite an interesting pupil as well. It's almost like a, a elongated pupil, not a perfect round pupil like most bigger mammals. And little ears. Not quite sure what these guys will weigh, but probably about 200 grams. A rough estimate. Two hundred grams, about a fifth of a kilogram, so it's about four hundred, just over four hundred. Uh, so it's about a third of a pound. Once again, you're never going to get, or not soon going to get another opportunity to see those nails as nicely as well. You can see, relative to the size of the animal, it makes them quite fierce or competent diggers. Very good at getting into little holes and breaking things open very quickly before whatever they're trying to catch can escape. That was good. In the distance there, at Bifelsuk Dam, we're about half a kilometer away. I just heard a hippo. So it means there's at least one big animal that we're going to see there, and who knows what else. So we're going to just move along nicely. Awesome, awesome dwarf mongoose so far this morning.